life doing some certain things okay so let's say how you wake up in the morning and do your normal routine is a structure something you've done for 21 days 35 days becoming structure so structure is something that is very important for you to master once you master structure structure brings you out of a uh, problem so when I say structure bring you out of problem, what do I mean? You can decide to put a structure to savings. Maybe every time money comes into your hand, you allow 30% to go into savings. You use 70% of the money for expenses. And that 30% you put into savings, you have consistent with it for five years. And when you do that continuously for five years, that is structure. In fact, you can even put that on autopilot by allowing the bank to help you remove it with the use of standing order. And once you do that, you have a structure. And that is a structure to be wealthy. Many people don't have structure. They just wake up, live their life, go anywhere, come back anytime, and they just live life anyhow. People that live life anyhow just see anything. So you can't be living anyhow and then become successful all of a sudden. No, anyhow life will not have any results. That's the truth. Even, you know, there are a lot of people that get themselves into betting and gambling. And they are thinking that, ah, once I just make it like this, one day I will just win 10 million. I will just win 100 million. Then I will not play again. And then I'll be spending that money. It doesn't happen like that. When the house is built, when the bricklayer is building the house, the house is building the bricklayer. What do I mean by that? What that simply means is that each time you are, you know, saving when you don't have a lot of money, the day you have a lot of money, it will have been part of you you will abuse that into yourself. So it's not going to be strange to you. So people that say, I'm gambling, I'm gambling, and once I make it, I will. you don't have that structure. You don't have that culture. You don't have that inside of yourself. And so you can't do that, okay? You cannot do that. You cannot do that. Why? Because it's not part of you already. Okay, structure has the capacity to change your life. So you need to have a financial structure. And one of the reasons why businesses fail is also because um, businesses don't have structure. Your business needs to have structure. And structure is what is going to take your business from level 1 to level 2 to level 3 to the level of scaling. So um, look at building structure. So. Um, I'm going to go on a short break right now, and then when I'm back, I will jump over to some of the questions I have on ground already, and then begin to look at some of those qu your questions. That makes it easier for me. So, but, um, okay, that makes it easier for me if I get your questions. So, um, I haven't said that, I think... The next thing I need to say is that um, as much as possible, one of the things that you can do for yourself is to look at um, what you have currently to be able to travel out. What you have will tell you what you need to put together to be able to travel out. So let's say you are a professional, you are working in... Um, a complaint and you've been doing that for some time so you built a career you could actually travel as a professional if you build business you could actually travel with your business if you build um, if you spend time in ministry there's also a way you can go about that so it all depends on uh, what you have done zero nine zero seven two two four five zero one eight is the WhatsApp plan. You can send me a WhatsApp question right now, and you can give me a call on zero seven hundred ten twenty one ten twenty one. That those are the 
uh, numbers with which you can call me right here in the studio. So, uh, what are some of the basic things a small business need to understand for it to function well? Now, a lot of small business owners uh, used to have some challenges about issue of money, issue of letting people know more about their products. Then they used to have issue of uh, employees. They used to have quite a number of issues. But this morning, what I'm going to be talking about is going to be on what can you do as a small business owner take your business to the next level. What are some of the little, little things you can get online that will boost your business? Number one is the landing page that tells people about your business from beginning to the end. Um, if you don't have a website, you might want to just use googlesites.com. Googlesites.com will help you to make a website and it's going to be free. You will just connect it to your email. It's going to be free. You just connect it to your email and um, everything that you are running or you are doing in your business, office address, Google map, the time you open, the time you close your office, ad, um, your office website, your everything is going to be accommodated there. So googlesites.com, that's a simple tool that you can use. It will help you boost your business and it can also serve as your landing page. Number two is you can develop a community on WhatsApp. On WhatsApp, you can build a community. Um, WhatsApp has what we call the WhatsApp group platform, but they also have community. Community is where you put everybody together, but everybody cannot see each other. You are the one that can see everybody at once. Nobody can see each other. They can only talk to you. That's the dynamics of community. And why do you need to have community? Because there are scammers. They can, they can get somebody's WhatsApp number and use that to attack all your other customers. That's why you need to set up YouTube community for your customers. If you are doing any form of business and you don't have the list of all your customers in one place, you need to begin to think about putting all of them on the WhatsApp group. Number three, you can use email marketing to greet them on their birthday. If you notice, you will discover that banks generally greet you on your birthday. They used to send message to you. You can also program um, details for your customers like that. They will put their birthday, they will put everything. And once they put all of that, they will be able to receive an automatic email on your on their birthday from your company and that will help you to keep the details of your customer now the strength of a small business is in the customer base the more customer you have the more the future of your small business and if you have less customer you can be sure that there's likely to be a problem soon so everything that can help you to keep customer base is what you should be doing. The next one I want to talk about is posting um, advert about your product. If people don't know about your product, there's definitely no how they will place order. One of the easiest thing you can do for yourself is to go to canva.com, make short video or images, or go to poster my wall make short video or images just drag and drop and then post them on social media consistently if you have a staff that is a little bit it inclined you can give that staff that responsibility all of those things are there to help you okay let me go on a short break when i am back i'll begin to take questions i'll open the phone lines and then I'll take questions. Stick around and go away.
Radio on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Fridays, 8 a.m. to 9 a.m. with successful song. Put a touch of class and finesse on the brand by advertising with us at Hollyback 1021 FM. For more information, call 0706. Welcome back, the Money Magna Show. So, um, 0907 is the phone line with which you can reach me right here. I mean, you can send me a WhatsApp uh, right here in the studio, and you can give me a call on 0700 1021 Okay, so. Uh, let me go to something about computer processor last um, on the last show I said if you are buying a laptop the most important out of the laptop is the processor now processor used to have a number and it ends with A P and H I said the H is the most effective because it simply means it's a gaming laptop. The P is good for coding. So, however, the A is uh, you're really not doing uh, so much with A. So, um, if you want to buy a laptop, um, if you buy a processor with a number that ends with H, that it's a good laptop but most times the processor that has the number that ends with H do not used to come cheap they used to be a little bit expensive so it all depends on what you want to achieve though uh, that's Mike from Ojudu 0907 that you can decide to rewrite the book. Let's assume you go to banco.ai. Yesterday, I wanted to write a job description on a particular post, and I went to banco.ai. I put the job description there, and banco.ai just write it out for me, you know, without any sweat. Um, if you want to use Banco.ai to write a book, just paste it there, get the book written, and then you can still take it on the same Banco.ai and give the Banco to rewrite it for you. It will still rewrite it for you. So that's the power of uh, AI technology. It can help you to write a book, and it will still help you to rewrite the book. Zero nine zero seven two two four five zero one eight is the number and uh, the whatsapp line that's the whatsapp line if you want to call me is zero seven hundred ten twenty one ten twenty one you need um, the video course so buy the video course uh, that will guide you to relate with an agent that will do that for you. Okay, so get the company that will export for you um, from Nigeria here. Give them the products and they move the goods to Canada. Then that can help you with papers. So um, let me look at guide you to funding your Beatspot account.
with success this summer. On High Impact Radio, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Fridays, 8 a.m. to 9 a.m. with successful summer. Okay, welcome back, and this is still the Money Magna Show. Uh, to call into the show, the number is 0700-1021-1021. If you want to send me a WhatsApp message, it's 907 that number. Okay, so having said that, let's look at this next Okay, this is Money Magnet Show. Hello. Uh oh. Okay, let's go on a short let's go on a short break. When we are back, we'll continue with the show. Stick around and go away. What could be going on? Um, almost done with the show, but I still have AdSense and domain. Now, as a 
an individual in Nigeria, one of the things you should seek to do is create an alternative or mm -mm, um, you should seek to create um, another stream of income by making sure that you uh, put money aside or you make extra money online and in, in such a way that it's going to be an autopilot. Um, it's quite important. A business that you are pushing online and then can by itself generate you money. You need a business like that. Um, and one of the ways to do that is to get a domain and get a blog and then uh, put Google AdSense on the blog, make the blog popular and then take advert on that blog. Um, so the question that person is asking for is that question. So uh, to automate your blog or your website is possible. And after automating it, then Google can now get you, um, can give you AdSense. AdSense is where you will now begin to make money when you attach it to that blog every single month. You know, <laughs> smart way to make money these days. And then you can now run advert on the blog. You can just run advert on the blog. And when you run advert on the blog, people see it. And then the more they see it, the, the more they are able to, um, you know, click on the Google advert and the more money you are able to make. So these are just fantastic stuff that can really help you. So that's the question the person is asking for. You don't need to be a tech person before you can do this. You can journey on a regular basis. Imagine yourself making as much as um, 200 to $500 every single month up to $1,000 every month. I mean, that makes a whole lot of sense, okay? That makes a whole lot of sense and is one of the things that I think you need to begin to look at. So that's the question that person is asking. You buy a domain, you put in a website on it, and then you drive traffic to it, and then all these things are done automatically. You don't have to do anything manually. And that is generating you up to a thousand dollars every month. That's about seven hundred and fifty, or three fifty, or two hundred. I mean, that's good for you, don't you think so? And all you just have to do is share the information out to uh, different platforms that can help you to uh, make money from it, and then you know, just like that. So those are those are the those are some of the things that you need to put in motion for yourself. Zero seven hundred ten twenty one ten twenty one is the phone number with which you can reach me right here in the studio by WhatsApp. And if you want to call me zero seven hundred, I mean you can call me on zero seven hundred ten twenty one ten twenty one. You can send me a WhatsApp message on zero nine zero seven two two four five zero one eight you cannot really make money on telegram directly than advertising on telegram and you cannot make money from facebook directly unless you advertise on facebook you spend money on those platforms to make money but if you want to make money without spending money online then you should think about using doing youtube you create content, you put it out there. Once you get 4,000 subscribers, 1,000 watch hour, then you make money. Okay, so that's what you just do on those platforms. Those platforms are just on the package you are buying. That's what we determine in saying this, that there are several ways to make money online about 1001 ways to make money online that you can be going to your office or you go to your business and then you are making money on your phone um, you go to your business and you just leave the online business is running itself 
and then all you are receiving on your phone is alerts and the alert is even in foreign currency it's not even in nigerian currency so it's possible that you can set that up and you don't have to be a tech guru the reason for the possibility of that is because the generation we are in is an ai generation and many things have been simplified um placed on auto processing such that you don't have any problem about getting um, complex things done to make money for you so i want you to begin to think about what you're going to do to really help yourself ask that question that's all i can take today till i come your way next time successful sum is my name and i'm saying remain financially intelligent